Oh, the happiness and blessings belonging to the one who keeps an eye towards the helpless. In the day of evil and misery, our Lord will deliver him. Our Lord will protect and keep him alive. In the land, he will be called happy. And our Lord will not surrender him to the cravings of his enemies. Our Lord sustains and supports him upon his couch of illness. And for my part, I have said, My Lord, favor me, be gracious and heal my soul, for it is against you that I have sinned. My enemies speak evil towards me, saying, When will he die, and his name become lost to memory? And if one has come to see for himself, he speaks empty and worthless words. His heart collects up any hint of my looming disaster for itself. And then he goes out and spreads it in the street. And all those who hate me as an enemy whisper together against me. Against me. To devise and plan evil and misery for me. They whisper, A wicked illness has been poured out upon him. He has been anointed. And where he has lain down, he will not arise from again. Yes, even a man of my peace, a good friend, one in whom I trusted, one with whom I have shared my bread. He has insidiously turned against me. But you, my Lord, please favor me, be gracious, and raise me up again, that I may reward them properly. By this I understand that you are delighted with me, that my enemies are not rejoicing in triumph over me. And for my part, you have taken hold in me, in my integrity and innocence, and you have placed me before your face forever. Praised and adored is our Lord, the God of Israel, from before time began and after time ends. This is certain. This is so. This is so.